What's happening here with you, huh? Look at Garbo. She usually hates men. So, food co-op, funeral home. Nothing with animals at all? Yeah, uh, no. Well, you know, but they're, they're all related in a way, you know? No. Well, people in grief, just, you know, they're a lot like dogs in the sense that you just have to be with them in a totally instinctive way. I never hired anyone with no dog experience. How many you got at home? Well, I had one when I was a kid. It was a terrier, but uh, he died suddenly, and my mom got so upset that she never let us get another one. And look, I learned fast. Why don't you just give me a trial run? What do you say? Thing is, hon, this job doesn't pay much. Well, I don't need much. Look, I just can't stand to be around people in pain anymore. You know, every time I walk by this place, it just, it just, I always look like life. Oh, here's Marlon. Hey, Thistle. Hey, Thistle. Hey, speak. Speak. Good boy. Good boy. Stay. 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 Okay, go find him. Go find him. Go on. Go on. <laughs> Good dog. Good doggy. Good time it. The winner is Shakti at seconds. <laughs> so do you want to be a trainer? Uh, no, not really. Do you? I used to. I really want to be a vet. I'm waiting to hear from UC Davis for next year. Oh, I'm sure you'll get in. <sighs> it's pretty competitive. You know, you should think about being a trainer. You're really good with them. Well, thanks, but kind of just enjoying doing this right now. So, Terry said you used to work at a funeral home? Yeah. Kind of depressing? Kind of. Hmm. Hey, do you think Terry would mind if I brought my little girl in here? You have a little girl? Yeah. She's two and a half. I, I didn't know you were married. I mean, you're not wearing a ring. No, I'm not. Married. Anymore. Hey, Boo. Good dog. <laughs> I'm just nervous. It's Maya's first night with the new sitter. She seems like a nice girl. I used to babysit when I was a kid. Huh? I hope you hit all your private papers. You mean you used to snoop around people's <laughs> private things? All the time. You wouldn't believe the stuff I found. Why do the ugliest people always have the dirtiest photos? I don't know. One time, this widow brought in the grossest photo of her husband to help with the embalming. <laughs> he was... Wait, you want me to describe him? Please don't. <laughs> so, how's it being back at work? Uh, it's been the same old, same old. <sighs> Just trying not to let him get me down. Right now, in my off hours, I'm concentrating on relaxing and having fun. Really? What kind of things you like to do? Oh my god, this is so dirty. <laughs> With your roommates, Maya, I just figured. Well, it's not that dirty. I'm sure they clean it once in a while. No. I meant this. This is so dirty. Seems sweet. You two would make a lovely couple. Well, she's just somebody to have fun with. We don't really have that much of a connection. That's because you won't let there be one. Nate, make a connection with her. No, she's not ready to settle down. Now you, you are ready to settle down. I'll say. But I think you two could get together and have a beautiful life. You can have the life with her you didn't give me. I can't. 
gave you everything I had, Liz. Right. Here's my advice to you. Stop with the cheap motels, stop sleeping with the crazy ex, and try to have a real relationship with this one. What's stopping you? The pain. What's that supposed to mean? I can't ever again go through the pain of starting a life with someone only to have it taken away from me. Oh, please. Whoa! Ouch, that hurt! Life is pain. Get used to it. Hey, you know what? Maybe you and me and Miley will do something fun this Saturday. What do you think of that? Oh, I fell down! <laughs> huh? She has two dogs. You love doggies, right? Hello! <laughs> oh, man, I can't wait till you start talking. What the hell are you doing? Calling Miley. Doing what you said, trying to start a relationship. With that girl? Are you crazy? That'll never turn into anything serious. Yeah, but last night, you told me that... I was desperate. I'm so fucking scared that you're gonna go back to Brenda that I'll do or say anything to stop it. If you have a relationship with Brenda, then I'll really be dead. Brenda's just sleeping with me because she really loves Joe. That's what she does. No, it's different this time. You love her and she loves you. And you should be with her before it's too late. <sighs> this is giving me a really bad feeling. Uh-oh. If I were you, I'd check that out. Might be a tumor. <laughs> uh -huh.